Showing ability at trials for the first time to the races today. All right, we're all in. Ready. Hang on, hang on, I'm not trying to get... two saying hang on, but the attendance go up, we're good now. They're often racing from the Kamada Park stalls, and Lincoln Fury was last out of the gates. Grand Ariana didn't have a lot of speed. Got the call, did though, and leads from Segunto and Aitan Nartin. He's a hoot on the inside, and Solon Victor's pushing through in the middle of those. A couple of lengths back then to Grand Ariana and a similar distance to Lincoln Fury, who settles down the last one as they spear down the back towards the end of uh, the back straight. And after the 800 metres, turning across the top here, and got the call in front. Segunto and Nickaway second. There's two lengths to He's a Hoot inside of Solemn Victus. Eight and Artin's a length off those. One and a half Grand Ariana. They've got 600 metres to go and Lincoln Fury was the last one as they near towards the corner. They've still got 450 metres to go as they turn. Got the call on the inside of Segundo. There are a couple of lengths in front. Solon Victus now looks to run on. Back behind these Eight and Artin. They race down to the 300 metres. Segundo on the outside have got the call. Segundo's rider feeling for the chalet he got the call a half length back and trying to rally Solon Victus and then Grand Ariana who's running on we've got Segundo in front on the outside Grand Ariana starting to wind up on the outside for Shafiq and perfectly timed right on the line in the Avantage Collar she'll win Grand Ariana the prize Segundo Solon Victus behind these runners then got the call Lincoln Fury 8 to Nathan, and he's a hoot Really made up a lot of ground here. Goes on to win. Number seven, Grand Ariana. Out of the Ultra Richard Stable and uh, Shafiq Rusov. Really creating a wonderful impression here in NZ with timing here. Segundo just having a look around for what he's meant to do and getting the head up a bit, but she had hers down and right to the line. Gets to him now and beats Segundo. Solon Victor says he's run well third. And another call will be fourth just in front. Oh, yes. Oh, that's close, maybe, in front of Lincoln Fury. But uh, she came with a well timed run here. Gee, Tone, I thought at the top of the straight this was a two horse race. The leading two got the call. Uh, and Segundo. The rest of them seem to be off the steel, battling back in the pack, but then late in the piece. Little filly by Snitzel has really got through a couple of gears under Shafiq and got right across the top of them. You've seen Solemn Victus make some good ground late. Uh, Segunto's kept on kicking. Got the call, was trying all the way down the home straight and was even possibly coming back on the fall before tiring late in the piece. But interesting race because there's a few back in this race that were really, really off the steel, but then they've picked it up and... Bang, Tiakau and Fortuna win again. Fortuna, Miss Ariana Syndicate, well done to the team here, the filly by Snitzel at Abenduja. For the Autridge and Riches team, Shafik Rusov uh, does the riding. So Gunto is second, the five Solemn Victors, and the six got the call. We'll just make up that first for DA. Pretty hard to beat when you've got those colours. The Fortuna slash sash added. Everywhere you look, two-year-old winners, they just seem to arrive.